Okay, next we have the brownie mix. And this is a basic brownie. I call it a mid-range brownie because it's right between a fudge and a cake brownie. If you want to make it cakey, you add an ounce of flour to a pound of brownie mix to make it more cakey. You want to make it fudgy, you add an ounce of sugar to a pound of brownie mix. And I came up with the most recent formula where I add a half ounce of flour and sugar, not an ounce of either or, to make a really great structured fudge brownie. So we're going to start off with how easy it is to make it. Add your water, one cup of water to a pound of mix, nothing else. Just mix it up. Of course, I'm doing it on a small batch here, but you can do it in a mixer. This is a type of product that doesn't need a mixer. You can do it in a mixing bowl. And that's one of the reasons why I'm demoing it this way, because uh, there's no mix time on it. And as soon as it's rehydrated and ready to go, you have a body. So I'm just mixing it to incorporate there. And there you are. That's the brownie. That batter, that simple, that easy. Now, just pour it into a pan. Spread it off, stick it in the oven, bake it at 350 for about 15 minutes, and you have a brownie. Now, here's the finished product, the way it looks when it comes out of the oven. It's firm, it's got a nice texture, that's a key factor. When you're touching it, all you have to do is feel it, and if it presses and it punches back, you know that it's finished. And here I have the finished product. Here is the actual brownie with the ganache icing. Now the ganache icing is really simple. You just warm up some soy milk and add some bittersweet chocolate chips to it, and you have a ganache. It's very similar to the classic ganache when I'm not using butter and heavy cream. I'm just using soy milk. If you want to add a little butter to it, I'm in the sense of the vegan butter or something, or palm shortening, or just even oil, you can get a little emulsify into it. And it's, to show you how nice it slices, I'm just going to cut a piece open here and hold it up to the camera. So look how fudgy that is. That is a real decadent, fudgy type brownie. And that's the way most people like it. The cake brownies, uh, some people like it that way. Most people like it this way. And that's why I'm showing this particular one. And the icing really makes it. The icing is really crucial because it, uh, picks the sweetness up. If people like something really sweet, they're going to want the icing on it. If they're more conscious about their sweetness, you can leave the icing off and they're going to love it. And again, recipes are available. You can uh, order product and the recipes will be sent to you with the product or samples. And it gives you more variations and some higher end techniques. Because this product, well, it's very simple here. If you go on my website, ecocuisine.com, you'll see pictures of like a horizontal, I should say a vertical hazelnut tort, a really great high-end product. So this is great for fine dining and campus dining and everything in between. So I look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.